It's Ty the Gadget Guy. Can you believe it? I ordered this thing because I really needed it. It arrived at the door and it's not even in a box. It's in its own box. It's not like in a big box I have to open. But my goodness, do you see what this is here in? It's a food saver vacuum sealer. So now I can take food and save it. I'm so excited. I'm going to open this thing and see what's inside. Look at this. All right. Pretty awesome. Now, you're probably wondering, why does anyone need a vacuum sealer? I'm gonna tell you. I have a friend that likes to go fishing a lot. And when he goes fishing, one can only eat so much fish. And families can only be made to eat fish only so often. So, there comes a time when you gotta put the fish into a bag and put it in the freezer. But if you put it in a regular Ziploc bag, it's not gonna be that good. Fastest way to get ice to taste like fish put fish in a Ziploc bag and put it in the freezer. Okay, I learned that the hard way. So let me tell you, this thing is gonna make a lot of happy people in my house, it's gonna make me happy because I'm gonna get fish whenever I want it. Other things can be used too, we'll go to that later. Anyway, I'll be right with you. User manual. Having not used this before, I wanna make sure I don't mess this up. Um, this was not the cheapest gadget in the world, so I wanna make sure I am doing exactly what I'm supposed to do because this thing, it's supposed to save me money, but it caught, there's a lot of upfront cost to this thing, so I want to make sure I'm taking advantage of this here. So I'm reading through this. All right, well, what's going to happen is we're going to come back. I'm going to have some stuff ready to put in the seal. We're going to see how good this thing works. Be right back with you. A little longer than a few minutes later. All right, I'm back. I've got a couple things going on. They have a quick start guide. It looks <coughs> pretty simple to use. I got the fish ready to go. I got the avocado. We're going to do the avocado first. Now the reason I'm doing the avocado is that I saw when I was getting this thing they had a picture of an avocado and they said air destroys food and they showed the avocado and it was like aged with air and then the avocado that was vacuum sealed it was all green and nice. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to cut the avocado, just a I'm going to cut the avocado here like so. It's a great avocado by the way, I don't know if you, you can't really tell what I'm, oh my goodness, look at that. that was just perfect. Twist it like that, beautiful avocado, okay. And I'm going to take the seed out because I don't want any, any, any one side to get the advantage here. And we're going to put this in. One of them is going to go in the Ziploc bag. Why the Ziploc bag? Because Ziploc bags are airtight. I'm going to squeeze all the air out of there as I can. And I'm going to zip it up. This avocado is in a Ziploc bag. The other avocado is going to go in the pre-made quart size bag that goes in the thing here. What we're going to do is we're going to put it inside the bag. And then... This thing was pretty self-explanatory the way you do it. You lift it up, you put this where you want it to go, right here, and then you close it, and you push this button to seal, like so, and it's not sealing. I gotta push this seal button, but I wanna vacuum and seal. It's got a vacuum and seal, so I wanna vacuum it out. So I'm gonna hit vacuum and seal. You hear it starting to do the vacuuming thing. It's sucking all the air out of there. Look at the way that's working, it's pretty cool. All the air is gone. Avocado is still green and nice. It's still doing its noise thing. It's done. So now, I think, do I push the seal button? No, it's off. So I lift it and vacuum sealed avocado. So we have vacuum sealed avocado and a Ziploc sealed avocado. We're gonna come back in a bit and find out how this works. Two days later. Hey guys, Ty the Gadget Guy checking back in. Two days since we've sealed these avocados. This is the avocado that was in a Ziploc bag. And this is our avocado that was in the vacuum seal bag. I'm gonna cut them both open so we can take a gander. See how bad or good these look. So we'll cut this open here and we'll take, I'll, I'll just open the bag this way. All right, as you can tell here, got a lot of um, discoloration there. Probably something that could be scraped away, but probably not too scrumptious. It doesn't look too good. This looking quite a bit better. Um, I'm imagining that this is a significantly better avocado. And if you compare the two, I mean, there's really no comparison. The vacuum seal is the way to go. So I'm going to say again, the vacuum sealer is awesome. And I definitely recommend getting that item. Um, I'm going to probably make some guacamole right now and uh, have it this avocado. Till next time. See you then. But now let's go ahead and do the fish. 
Like I said, I have a buddy that brought back a whole lot of ahi. I made a ridiculous amount of ahi pokey, and we had seared ahi, but there's still ahi left. And I don't want it to go bad, and so vacuum sealer is the way to go. Well, this ahi here is going to go into the bag. Again, I got the pre-made gallon bag, so we don't have to go through the process of cutting this on camera because that could be a disaster. And so we put that in here like this, and then put this piece in there like this, and then we're going to turn this here into the deal, lift it up, go like so, and again, we want to vacuum seal this the same way we did before. We close it, we just push the lock rotate button here, I mean, yeah, rotate and lock button, and then hit vacuum seal. There it goes. How easy is that? Incredible. This is pretty awesome, folks. I'm going to have a lot of fun with this. Um, I imagine putting a whole lot of things in vacuum sealing now because why put it in the freezer if it is a vacuum seal? All right, we're ready. Let's look at this. Woohoo! All right, vacuum sealed ahi tuna. Okay, so the important thing is you, you want to write on this thing and put it in the freezer, but let's face it, I'm going to eat this like in the next week or two. I'm just going to drop it in the freezer and take it out and make some more food with it. But my goodness, this vacuum sealer is pretty awesome. Guys, the food saver, number one vacuum sealing system. I can't compare it to any other vacuum sealing system, but this one worked pretty well. It did exactly as it said. All together, I like it. Um, so I'm telling you right now, Ty the Gadget Guy says, food saver vacuum sealer, definitely want to get this thing. Definitely something to do. Make sure you subscribe. Please share. Let's join the Gadget Gang and make it get bigger and bigger. We'll see you next time. <laughs>